Did you feel it? Did you feel it when you died? Wake up, one-eyed Willy. Wake up! Amanda, am I at my mother's house? You ain't at nobody's mother's house. Nick Fury. Mr. Goodhoff? Oh, oh. So all rabbits look alike to you. It just so happens that I happen to be Mr. Goodhoff's father, Senior Goodhoff. But, but Mr. Goodhoff told me that his father was killed and eaten by the horrible abomination known as the Honey Boo Boo. True. I was devoured by the She-Beast. But my spirit wasn't. Instead, it went here where most spirits go. But wait. If, if you are in the afterlife and, uh, and I am here with you, then... That means... I'm... I'm dead! Wow. Nothing gets past you, Snake Diskin. Oh, great. I am dead, son of a bitch. Oh, God. I knew it. But, but... Uh, but... But how? The last thing I remember is... Uh, but how? The last thing I remember was being electrocuted while trying to get rid of... Geek... Lucian. I've been watching over you, mad uh, moody. Ah, I knew they would cause the death of me. I just didn't think it would be this comedic. Well, that does explain why Elvis is here. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'll be here all eternity. Oh. And the nostalgia critic. This is so so am I in hell right now? Or or am I am I in heaven? And if so, which heaven? Because I specifically wanted Christian heaven. Do you know how in most depictions of heaven it's a place where the person loved when they were alive? Yeah, so well if heaven looks like a place they loved, and hell would be a place they hated, then in between would be a place that they felt neutral about when they were alive. So tell me, how did you feel about your mother's place? Uh, how do I feel about my mother's place? Eh, well, I kind of... I don't like coming to my mother's place, but at the same time, I can tolerate it. Exactly. You're neutral about it. Which means you're in between heaven and hell. Purgatory. Purgatory? But, but Christians don't believe in purgatory. There comes a time in every man's life that they have to deal with some crazy shit they don't believe in. Well, uh, that's true. Ah. Uh. You get to spend your whole eternity here with us. Us dead gods. Uh -huh. Wait, wait a minute. If I'm in purgatory, that means that I am technically not completely dead. Well, some believe 
that everything that happens on Earth happens for no damn reason. But others believe that we were each put on that planet for a reason, a job to do. If you go to heaven, that means you did good on your job. If you go to hell, you did bad. And if you go to purgatory, you ain't done with your job yet. Well, I understand Elvis, right? He was He's here because he never finished his music career. No, Governor. It wasn't. His job was to finish that dump he was taking. But he never finished it. On the count that he died. Oh. Well, it's more than obvious what I have not finished. I have yet to finish destroying Geek Evolution. Yeah, that was something that you did not finish. But are you sure that that was the job that counted? What? Surely that is it. What, you think you, you imply there's something else? Hey, I'm just saying... Really? Because from the looks of it, it looks like someone else is going to achieve that goal. What? Who, who, who is it? Is it that Sonic guy whose name escapes me except he looks like that head and shoulders football player? Mikhail Bakunin, you dumbass. Then it must be Doom Space. Surely whatever he's planning on is not that big of a deal. If it's not a big deal, then how come his plan's taken a whole year to do? No. No. It can't be true. That's impossible. No. Day. Oh no. Listen, Senor Good Hop. I have no time. You got till January. Odin. He will be the one to take over Geek Volusion instead of me. And it has to do with Spawn for some reason. Listen, I got to get out of here. Surely there is a way. If you go to heaven or hell, then your fate is pretty much sealed. But if you go here to Purgatory, you do have one, just one chance of returning back. To laugh. And in your case, that exit is the door over there. Most of us choose to stay here because of the possibility of going to hell. But I don't recommend taking that exit because most people who try wind up dying. But aren't they already dead? If you die in purgatory, then you go straight to hell for being a dumbass. Good God. Okay, enough with all the rules. Ah, this is more complicated than an episode of Lost. You know, come to think of it, with all the dead people and the idea of purgatory, it does, this does seem like an episode of Lost. Yeah, there are similarities more than you know about. What on earth do you mean? What was that? Wait, you said that most people failed, which means there is a chance that I could be one of those who makes it. If you were as smart as me, Cogburn, then you would just stay put and accept what happened. Well, how am I supposed to know that there was something I was supposed to do before I died if I can't go back? Come on, come on, back me up. Come on, back me up, Elvis. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave you guys too alone. Oh, well, thank you very much. Yeah, I better you split too. Goodbye, I'm the nostalgia village. Looks to me like they decided to go back to their Perga dorm rooms. What? What, is there anything stopping me from taking that door of light there? <laughs> Damn it. Fine. You know what? 
I'm just going to prove to you that I can do it. I don't care what happens to me if I try to get out of this purgatory as long as I know that I was stupid enough to do it. Then go, Lily Childs. See if I care. Okay then. Okay. Alright, here I go.